Okay, I did want to show you guys the lightning arrester. This is it right here. Got it on Amazon. I want to show you guys, like, this is the legit one right here. You guys can see it's it come in this bag, this bag, a package on it. And this is it right here. Let me pull it out so you guys can see. Now, this is a legit one right here because what we're going to do is we're going to put the grounding wire in here. And then we're going to clamp this red, uh, this little red tube right here. We're going to clamp it on to the actual grounding wire and it's going to stay on there the last one we did was kind of like finicky so that's why we bought this one and i do want to show you guys the different connections here okay so right here this is an end type male okay and you guys can see that it actually screws and there is a point on the inside that's why it's the male you got to like pay attention to these different connections because it's hard to try to get everything aligned but if you guys are paying attention to what you're ordering you're going to get it okay so this is an end type female you guys could see it kind of looks like a male from the inside but it there's a hole on it right where the male it's like a pointy tip and then the female you could actually see that there's a hole on the inside and then so this is n type female this is n type male okay so this is the six dbi antenna that we bought okay so this is the female let me show you guys this is the female right and you guys could see it has that point but it's it's empty in the middle Okay, so we're going to take our male and our female and we're going to connect these two right here. Okay, and then so I also got this cable right here. It's an LMR 400. I got this off of Amazon, you guys. Okay, so on this side, we do have the female, right? And then this is the male, N-type male. And what we're going to do is we're going to screw this in like so. So I do want to point out that the inside of this red, it has the metal, right? So as long as we're putting this in, we're just going to push it all the way through. And when we clamp this, that metal piece, it's touching the screw and it's going all the way in. So the lightning arrestor, it's gonna do its job right there. And uh, one thing I wanna talk about the lightning arrestor is like, if lightning straight up hits it, um, it's probably gonna like fry your miner, okay? So what it helps is if lightning does hit it, the electricity is supposed to run through the ground wire, right? And it's supposed to give all the electricity to the actual ground, like the dirt. And it's not supposed to, you know, catch your roof on fire. So that's the whole point of having this lightning arrestor. It is for safety. Some people told me that they don't use this and they earn more when they actually take it off. But it's a, it's a safety concern and it's up to you guys what you guys want to do. What we're going to do is we're going to clamp it with our wires here. We're just going to squeeze it and it should fit right on it like that. Okay, you guys, so we just tightened it. You guys could see that I'm, I'm tugging on it, but uh, I do want to secure it. And, you know, it's going to look a little finicky, but we are going to put some zip ties on it just to make sure everything's nice and tight right here. But it's just, it's very tough to put these grounding wires on these arresters. But as long as the metal's touching metal, we should be good to go. And uh, that's what we're doing here.